One of our more basic triggering techniques is edge triggering. Edge triggering is an easy and reliable technique to capture most signals. It allows the user to set a threshold which the signal must cross for an instance to occur. Edge triggers, like most of our triggers, allow you to choose your source. For this case, I can choose between channel 1, 2, 3, and 4, and then our digital channels. I can also go ahead and choose between slope, either rising edge or falling edge to trigger on, or even both. And then I can also trigger on different signal acquisition techniques between auto, which I'm doing right now, and just show the difference. I'm going to move the trigger threshold off of the waveform, and as you can see, auto is continuously running. It's basically forcing a trigger looking for a new waveform. And if I bring the threshold down, I'm going to switch it over to normal. And then once it's on normal, I'm going to do the same thing, move the threshold off. And as you can see, unlike auto where it's forcing a trigger, normal is just going to keep the waveform there until it sees another trigger event. And then finally, I can switch it over to the single, which it's not going to trigger until I bring the threshold down so it crosses the threshold. <laughs> And then for this instance, if I move the threshold off, it's not going to continuously trigger or look for a new signal. It's just going to capture it and stop looking for more information. Edge triggering is a useful technique to capture most waveforms along with capturing an unknown signal.